Hello Linux fans, Rob here. Welcome to Linux Quest. Well, I got the itch to start theming my Plasma desktop with my KDE Neon install. And one of the icon sets that's just fantastic and does very well with the Plasma desktop is the Sardi icon set. So I wanted to share that with you. I think the two are really a match made in heaven as far as theming is concerned because the Sardi set applies so well throughout your system. So we're going to hop over here to the ericdubois.be website and you'll see that there's a lot going on here including Arco Linux. So Eric is the developer for Arco Linux and uh, does a phenomenal job with tutorials and everything on Arco. And by the way, there's a new release tonight uh, at the airing of this video and I think it's the XFCE desktop version so you may want to check that out and we'll have to check that out here at Linux Quest as well. But Eric also maintains the Sardi icon set, so if we start here, you'll get a rundown of everything that's kind of new here with the inversion 9.3. And there are um, many versions of the Sardi set, and I go with the ARC version. But we'll also put a link to the direct download here to version, I'm sorry, that's now 9.6, not 9.3, so that was last updated. Uh, very recently here uh, on the 9th. So the way we're going to apply that is you'll simply download this uh, zipped file here, this tar file, and once that has downloaded from this link, you can then within KDE go into settings, go over to icons, and choose install from file. Now there's another way that you could do it and that would be to copy it over into your icon folder. Um, but this is also a very easy way to do that. So then you'd point it to your download folder and choose the downloaded file. And once you do, it will appear here to install and start the ins install process. Now you'll see with this pack, you get the various themes. So you have default Sardi, Sardi Arc, which I have in, in place here. There's Cholera, so on and so forth. So it will add quite a few of the variations of Sardi right here into your icon theme selection choice. And so you can go through and try them all. Uh, here's Ghost. I think that would work really well with, um, with really dark themes. So uh, have fun with this. But the reason that I really like this is I like the the round highlight around everything so there's a border around everything and so the icons really stand out depending on the theme that you have in place but the other thing that's really nice about this is if you scroll through and we'll, we'll just do that briefly there's no missing icons now there may be one or two depending on the version you choose and then there's one other thing I'll show you here so if you go into system Typically what you'll see with Sardi Arc is that Dolphin shows a standard folder icon, but within KDE that's easy to change. You can right click on your application launcher, go into edit applications, and you can do this for any of the icons that are um, set up within the application launcher. And then from there you can go into system. So for example, you see here screensavers that icon is showing a folder. If you decided you didn't want that, you want it to be round as well, you can simply click on this uh, icon here. We'll go ahead and pull this out so that you can see all of the icons. And then you can start scrolling and you'll see uh, various application icons. If you wanted to see all of the icons, which would then show you all of the Sardi icons, you could choose all and then go from there and choose another icon, uh, one that's round so that's in keeping with the rest of the system. So for now, I'm just going to quickly choose something. I think that was screen capture. Um, even though this is Athena, this kind of looks like a monitor within a circle. So I'm going to choose that and you'll see it pop up right there immediately. Just click save. And now that is also round like all of the other icons. So. It, it works so well with the entire system, it, it almost feels native. And that's just how complete that icon set is. So thank you, Eric, for all of your work there and continuing to 
uh, support that icon set and look forward to checking out Arco Linux. All right, that's it for now. We'll wrap it up and hope everyone has a great weekend. Thanks for watching.